What's up, scooter lovers? We have a, f a fun video for you today. We got, a, we got a cool new toy here. It's a familiar toy, but it's slightly, slightly different. The Varla Pegasus. We've seen it before. We've seen it on this channel. I talk about it a lot. It's my favorite sleeper. It's a total sleeper scooter. We've had this scooter. We already had the scooter once. And uh, we loved it. And then Varla said, hey, do you want that P Varla Pegasus again? I was like, well, I already got one. They're like, yeah, but this one has one inch larger wheels. So I was like, oh, okay. I guess it's an off-road version or something. I don't know. We'll check it out. Um, this isn't an unboxing video because I think it's pretty quickly. I think it unboxes fairly quick. We'll go for a world record here. I know we get, uh, I know we get some goodies with these Varla things. Looks good. Where am I going to put this box? That's something I didn't really think about. Wow, looks, looks nice. Boom, unboxed. Uh, this scooter is sick because it has the same profile as like a rental scooter. I guess the suspension's a bit, bit beefier. Oh, this looks a little beefier too, the locking mechanism. What's new on this? Well, the tires are one inch larger. These are nine inch tires. And they have more of an off-road pattern. I believe, I think the old one, yeah, had more street style tires. But yeah, it looks like the only difference is that uh, tires are bigger and they updated this locking mechanism to be a little more beefy. Otherwise, it looks like the same old scooter that we know and love. Let's see what we got here in the box. Another box. I seriously need to deal with this garbage situation immediately. I should have thought this out. I'll just go in the woods and burn it probably. Cool ass tool. Nice. Lock. That's the free gift. And then this is the charger, I'm assuming. Sick. Uh, I got a promo code for uh, for Varla. If you if this video inspires you to purchase one, use my link in the pinned comment down below. I don't know what you get, but I get $50 Venmo literally as soon as you click add to car, uh, checkout. I literally Venmo Varla literally just Venmos me Which is pretty cool because the other affiliate guys you have to wait till the end of the month and they have to you know They they're a little shady, you know, <clears throat> not gonna mention anyone Specifically <clears throat> Aesop Rocky's favorite bike <clears throat> um, uh, Yeah, some of the affiliate companies are uh, the affiliate programs are a little shady and uh, there's a class action lawsuit currently underway here. You gotta treat your influencers right guys. There's a little hack you can do in the P settings with this scooter that we're gonna do immediately. I'll show you guys that. Little Easter egg. Boom. Done. Simple, simple unboxing process. Now what do we do with this box? Activate. There it is. That classic screen we know and love. And it is full. Oh cool, I thought I was gonna have to... Wait, one mile? I just turned around. What are you talking about one mile? Got one mile on the odometer. Wow, it's beautiful. It's gonna haul ass. We're gonna... We're gonna... We're gonna destroy all the rental scooters. Okay. 
We are out here at the library. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That's a Pegasus right there. This, uh, the dampener in the front seems a bit stiffer than the last one, which will be good for high speeds. I wonder if the top speed is crazier on this. I think the only difference is, I think the only difference is the wheel diameter, but we'll see. First, we gotta scope out this uh, construction site to see if there's a dumpster somewhere where we can toss this. Oh, there is. It's just over there a little ways. It's gonna have to be a nighttime job. So right now we're in a uh, pass three, which is fast mode, but we haven't done the little secret. We haven't done the little secret in the, the settings, the little cheat code. Our, uh, our goal today, well, first thing is first, we gotta get some food. First thing we gotta do is get food. And then uh, we're going up here to South Congress, which is scooter heaven. Bird scooters everywhere. We are going to uh, flex on some rental scooter people because some of those people, they be hauling ass. Some of those people be hauling ass like they own their scooter, but they don't own their scooter. They're renters, just like everybody else. Just buy your scooters, guys. Don't spend 70, 80 bucks a month renting them. This is a little section of Austin we haven't been to yet. Wow, beautiful, beautiful skyline view. Uh, look at this, the freaking winter's over. The depressing three week winter is finally over. How's it going in Minnesota? Is, is, it, is it over over there yet? All right, let me show you guys the little trick here. Hold both of these down. That gets us into P1. Now, how do we switch? Oh, there we go. So P12, go to P12, crank that to five. Oops. And that is your current, and I think that, if we did it correctly, that makes it really, really zippy off the line. That dude is picking his nose at a popular intersection. Bro, stop picking your nose. Oh, at least he didn't eat it, that's good. Another cool thing about the Pegasus is that it has explosion proof vacuum tires no air no air so super minimal maintenance and you don't have to worry about running over shit see here's what sucks about scooter vlogging is that you can't really see the handlebars so it kind of just looks like i'm a camera that it looks like drone footage Looks like a drone just flying through uh, Austin here. There's a secret bar down here. Oh yeah, Egos. There's a secret bar that does karaoke. Uh, and I went there the other night and the karaoke guy said, if you guys want to sign up to sing, just download this app, create an account, and add to the queue. I'm like, what the hell? Why would I do that to sing karaoke? I need an app to sing live karaoke. That doesn't make any sense to me, sir. I will not be giving you my data. Oh, nice, we got a whole, we got a gang of three. Nice, this is our plan. Oh, she owns that one. E-bike rental. No copy, no stoppy. Peace. 
That girl was clearly not racing me. She was probably just riding safely. What we gotta do is find one of them teenagers that likes to rent the scooters and then huck it off handicap ramps and shit like that. Should I pass the Beamer on the right? What's happening there? All right, you're getting past, lady. Past the beamer. All right, red light, red light. We're gonna chop these cars off the line. These cars that are not racing. Chopped him off the line, but uh, you know, obviously, obviously, we're not going to beat a Rav Four. Six miles, haven't made a dent in the old energy bar. It's pretty cool. I hate to get my uh, nice brand new scooter all dirty, but it does have off-road wheels, and they're one inch bigger. So I think we have to. I'm trying not to scratch or dent this thing at all. My other one got beat up in the old bus and just, you know, letting people ride it. Oh, that feels nice. Ooh, ooh. So this is the Bat Bridge. This is the bridge where everyone comes here at uh, evening time. And they sit around and wait for the bats to come out. And sometimes they don't come out. Sometimes they just don't come out, which is, I think what happened when I went to look at them or else I just didn't I just didn't care to see them. Nice. That was weird. I was like, what's gonna happen here? Let's get out of here. It smells and uh, we're getting our things super dirty. Let's go into the town. The town of Austin, the city. Yeah. Yeah, this guy's going to work on his scooter. Watch out. Scooterman. Scooterman coming through. See you later, chump. 
have fun spending 35 cents a minute or whatever the hell it costs. Like it wasn't even a hill. That guy just said that's awesome, but was he talking about me? Most likely. Damn it. Scraped it. Scraped it on the curb. Damn. Vulcan, there was Vulcan during the day. I wish you guys would have seen this amazing Suron. Wasn't that amazing, it was black like they all are, but it had tiny little wheels. And it just looked dope. Oh, there he is. Dude, that's literally him. That's literally Saron, buddy, I was just talking about. Dude, that's Saron, friend. Dude, he has a silent Saron. I got a Suron too. What's that? I got a Suron too. Nice. That yours is nice. You got the KO motor and everything. Oh yeah. You like it? Oh yeah. You can do wheelies with it? Uh, not with this, these wheels. Dude, you're like oh. a street legal Suron. Oh, uh, pretty much. That looks so sick, buddy. I got lights and everything. <laughs> I would say let's race, but uh, you got me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, before this, I had a. Oh, really? It looks exactly like that. Nice. Because it's bad, I think. Did you, were you out at the Houston Mega Ride? I was out of town. Oh, really? I wish. I was there. It was 120 Surons. It was yeah, amazing. Yeah. It looked awesome. Yeah. There are a bunch of guys in town that have them now. I keep running across them. Yeah. yeah. I see them all the time, but I'm always on something that's not my Suron, so I can never catch up. <laughs> <laughs> Some of those guys have the giant, like, uh, like 21 inches in the front. Oh, yeah. in the back. They can do this at like 90 miles an hour. I want to do the 16 in the back, the yeah. fatter one. Yeah. yeah, these are 12, so it's really nimble, but not quite as fast. Damn, dude, you're just so tricked out. Yeah, and then I got a belt drive too, so it's quiet. Man, I've seen the little wheels, but not those not those ones. I don't know people, I think, in the ride without these. How much you spend on that? Too much. <laughs> Too much, I bet. That's always what I say. <laughs> but it's like, that's the way to travel. Oh, yeah, it, not far. Yeah, that's like, that. dude. I mean, considering how much I spent on this, I probably should have just gotten a car, but <laughs> yeah. here I am. Nah, dude, that's more of a head turner than like a Lambo. For sure. <laughs> See you later, man. Due to divine intervention, I crossed paths with him again. Super sick, sir. Let's go, let's take a right here. Is this the library? God, we just we just tore through that little section there. That was pretty fun. Probably shouldn't have been doing that. Yeah, should we drive through this water? Sick. What is this place? Alliance Children's Garden. Only in Austin. Man, this place is crazy. Crazy libraries, crazy uh, playground.
crazy bike infrastructure. Whoa, little hobbit holes. Whoa. That looks like a mini golf course, but it's literally just a free place for children to play. That is going to be the vlog, ladies and gents. Thank you for tuning in. Hope that you like the new Varla. Uh, huge shout out to Varla Scooters for sending me the new and improved Varla Pegasus. The uh, wheels are one inch bigger. We got nine inch off-road wheels on this one. What are the pros about this scooter, e-bike, scooter bike? Um, well, I think it's a total sleeper, which is pretty cool. And it has vacuum wheels. So the wheels are solid. They don't pop. Look out, squirrel. Uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. This is like, this is what rental scooters should be made out of. Uh, but no, it's a consumer scooter. So if you want to go off road, you want to shred off road with a scooter, you totally can with this. You can also daily commute with it. So it's pretty sweet. If you want to pick one of these up or the new Eagle One, which we'll probably be seeing soon on this channel, use my Varla promo code link down below. Supports your wallet, supports the channel, and Varla will Venmo me $53 as soon as you do. So that is sick. Uh, yeah, guys, thank you for supporting the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Consider subscribing if you enjoyed the vlog. Hit that like button and ding the notification bell. Chase your dreams. Good enough isn't. Get after it. Peace.